In this video, we are going to discuss example 24. Write down the first four terms of the following expansions. State also the interval for which the expansions are valid. Question A. 1 minus 3x to the power of negative 3. Here, the power number given is a negative integer, negative 3. So, we are going to use this binomial formula. Let us find x and n by comparing 1 minus 3x to the power of negative 3 with 1 plus x to the power of n. As we see here, x is equal to negative 3x and n refer to the power number which is negative 3. Now, we are going to substitute x and n into the binomial formula. Next, we are going to simplify this expression. So, we got 1 plus 9x plus 54x squared plus 270x cubed plus dot 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 as our final expansion. Now, let us take the range of validity for this expansion. We know that for the original expansion, 1 plus x to the power of n, the expansion is valid for absolute x less than 1. So, in this case, we are going to replace the x with negative 3x. So this expansion is valid for absolute negative 3x less than 1. Then we have absolute 3x less than 1 because the modulus will get rid of the negative sign. Now factor out the 3. Divide both sides by 3. We have absolute x is less than 1 over 3. 3. This means x is between negative 1 over 3 and 1 over 3. So the interval in which the expansion is valid is negative 1 over 3, 1 over 3. Next, let's move on to question B. 1 over set 1 plus x. Let us express this as a power negative 1 over 2. We notice that the power number is a negative fraction. So, similar with the previous question, we will use this binomial formula. Now, let us identify x and n by comparing 1 plus x to the power of negative half with 1 plus x to the power of n. As we see here, x is equal to x, remain the same, and n is negative 1 over 2. Now, let us substitute this into the formula.
simplifying this expression. So we got 1 minus 1 over 2x plus 3 over 8x squared minus 5 over 16x cubed plus dot 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 as our final expansion. Next, let us state the range of validity for this expansion. This expansion is valid for absolute x is less than 1. Or in other words, x is between negative 1 and 1. So, the interval is negative 1, 1. Well, that's it. Thank you.